continues at 10 News. I am Billy Bob Joe, your host, your grateful person. We promise we're not biased, but then again, I'm on the TV, so give or take. Our first story reports of a werewolf with an IQ of 1, maybe negative 1, we don't know, which attacked a radiator because it burnt its fur. I swear this is true. We have footage of this occurrence. And here we have the werewolf, who people have been taken to call Lady Gaga Mark II. It is a metre tall and is generally very hairy, except for this bit here, which is oil, oil funnily enough. And that is because it was burnt. It's true. And now we go to the weather. Thanks, Billy Bob Joe. Now on to weather. Hi, I'm Chloe and welcome to the weather report. Today it has been very cold and Frida will show us that now. And John O'Groats. Yes, it is very cold today. I've seen people going past shivering. They're all wearing jackets and coats to keep warm from the cold. And I really should have brought a jacket. Over to you, Chloe. Thanks for the report from John O'Groats. That's us all done for tonight. We'll see you in the morning. Over to you, Billy Bob Joe. Now we will take it over to our lovely gossip ladies that are talking about Kim Kardashian. Maybe. I don't know. Hi, this is me, Lindsay, and my crazy sister, Susan. It's Susie. Okay, and her crazy duck friend, Susanna. It's Sharon. And we're here with the gossip. Taylor Swift broke up with her boyfriend at Christmas and then got back and then got back together. Unfortunately, they broke up again and then got back together after the Christmas holiday. Justin Bieber wrote a new album to say sorry, aka the song Sorry. Ed Sheen was on the new show on Dateable on Comedy Central. Now we're on to movies. Will Smith says he's not attending this year's Oscars as voters hit back against controversy. A cinema in Liverpool it will be showing Groundhog Day for, ground, for 24 hours on Groundhog Day. Christopher Nolan's films rank from best to worst later on. On, on to, to Billy Bob, Bob Joe. Joe. Our second story reports of several slaves found underneath a Tascot car parking lot. They have been reported they found under a Royce Rose. I'm not saying they did anything, but... However, other conspiracy theorists, which I am not, say that it was Tascot themselves, not the people that made the Royce Rose. I think they're wrong. In other news, we have reports of a speech impediment disease, also known as grammar disease, which we actually have a victim of, locked up in solitary usually, but I didn't, I'm not part of the NHS, so. Mm. So can you please come here? Stop back in there, please. Stop that. No, bad. Okay. Anyways. So say hello to don't know your name. Anyways, so, if you may please read this whilst I subtly kick to talk about that bit. Hello, how's your feet? Do you wash your brush teeth? I believe that's all we're going to get out of her today because the rest of it is just stuff about toilets. I swear that's true. So please send her back to where she came from. No, not the dungeon, the other place. No, no, no. No, not China either. Anyways, I thank you for coming to our show and watching our weekly bias. And Mr Ducky also thanks you. Say hello. He said bye. We thank you for watching. Bye. Have a nice life. <laughs>